the pitch, on the pitch, particularly on the pitch. I think he was he was a confident um, footballer, um, not as confident person. His style was was something that he worked on and he overcame. Um, I was really impressed when I first met him at Aston Villa, where you know, he came from Spain and it was unknown. Um, he could speak fluent Spanish, and and, and what he was was a was a lover of football and enjoyed his time outside of football when we worked hard and you know, I think the balance he struck was, was was a good one and one that fitted him and he was very happy with it. spoken to him probably a couple of months before and I know he was suffering from some liver or kidney problems and you know they were investigating it and then to hear you know, the, the circumstances in which his death came about was it was mind-boggling um, how such a, an excessive use of force, it appears, was was needed or was thought required. Um, as, as I've said before, I think um, that the investigation needs to be thorough, it needs to be fair and it needs to be concise because there has to be answers that come out of this that surely that the, the powers that be can learn from it and you know, maybe we can stop another unfortunate um, and, and appears senseless act of, of aggravation that led to his death uh, because it, it doesn't seem as though it was something that was necessary.